Consider this, you need a new roof, plumbing work, or even a new house, but there's no one available to do the job. Analysts say more than 3 million skilled trade jobs will remain open by 2028 as the labor gap widens and generations of skilled trade workers retire. Matt Resinger, the top professional contractor, joins us now. Matt, can you tell us how this impacts everyone? You know, this is a huge impact for us as a nation and specifically me as a builder, this massive gap. We've got trades that are an aging generation. A lot of them are retiring and we need those young people to come up and take those jobs. Can you imagine if you've got a need for a plumber, an electrician at your house and there's no one to come do that job? This really affects us all. So Matt, what's happening uh, today at the Rose Bowl Stadium? You know, we've got a really fun day going on at the Rose Bowl. The guys at Lowe's and Skills USA and several other organizations have put together a charity event along with Skills USA. We've got 300 uh, young carpenters here. These are high school students that are coming to build bunk beds for a charity called Sleep in Heavenly Peace. This is a charity that gives uh, beds and mattresses to families and children in need, and a hundred of them are going to be built right behind us today. That's really awesome. So why did organizers want to host this event? You know, as a nation, we need to really talk about this skills gap and this massive need for these skilled trades and for young people to know about them. So really, this is an awareness event. But if you've got a young person or you know someone who might be a fit for this, we'd love to come have you come check out our website, wearegenerationt.com. This is a great resource for you to see what's available for training and for a career path in your area. Now, how important is that resource for people that might be wanting to get into the trades? You know, it's hard as a young person thinking about how they might get into that trade. If you've got an aunt or an uncle who's a plumber, that might be a way to get into it. But most people don't necessarily have a, a path or, or a way to get into the trades. So by going to this website, you can actually type in your zip code and then you can find local opportunities in your area for both training and for job opportunities. Matt, that's really great. Thanks so much for joining us. You guys can head over to our website, firstcoastliving.net. Check this segment out again.